We have functions and derivative of functions. And we have functionals and derivative of functional, right? Why do we use derivative of functions, for instance? Well, one of the uses of uh, derivative of functions is to look to get extremum, extrema of a function, a maximum, a minimum, a subtle point. So imagine that we have a function, now a function, not a functional, and we want to compute what are the extrema, the maximum or the minimum of this function. What do we do? We compute the derivative of this function and look at the points where this derivative is zero. And that is what we call a local minimum or a local maximum of the function. Are you familiar with that? OK. So that is very important, We're approaching the concept. Now we have functionals. So what do we do if we want to find the extrema of functionals? So the points where the functionals, the functionals get maximum or minimum in front of any perturbation. OK? Well, the condition is that. If we want to find a maximum or an extreme or maximum or minimum of a variational principle, what you have to do is just of la, uh, imp impose the degato derivative of the functional for any direction compatible. I mean, just imposing that these directions, these perturbations directions are zero delta u are equal to zero. Okay? So, if we now imply that the Gato derivative of a functional is equal to zero. So the general expression of that would be something integrated omega of something times delta u, but integrated on gamma sigma of something times delta u equals zero for all delta u, which is unmissable. This is what is called a variational principle. So now we have arrived to the concept of variational principle. What is a variational principle? Well, mathematically, it's an expression that impose that the derivative, the gato derivative in any compatible directions of any functions belonging to a certain set of functions is zero. More intuitively, more physically, imposes that at the point, so at the point, for the functions, for the solution of that problem, when u fulfills that, that u defines a maximum or a minimum of what? of the functional, okay? So we are going to use functionals and gato derivative of the functionals to find extreme of functionals in what are called variational principles. Variational principle is just that the gato derivative of a certain functional is equal to zero. That is a variational principle. 